Mark Grossman, Salman Bashir, and the Deputy Foreign Minister of Afghanistan. Uh, as an immediate neighbor and United States, we want to be helpful to that process. The second aspect of our consultative uh, mechanism that we call the core group is also to focus, and I must say we, with a great deal of satisfaction, that increasingly we are focusing more on issues relating to developmental cooperation. Uh, that is uh, Afghanistan and Pakistan and the broader region, and with the support of the United States and of the international community. We are very happy to see Ambassador Mark Rossman here in Islamabad once again. He has had a very full day of meetings uh, today and yesterday and uh, uh, the, the Foreign Minister had a very good interaction with Master Grossman and also bilaterally with the uh, Deputy Foreign Minister of Afghanistan, Brother Javed Ludin, we have had a very good bilateral interaction, that is Pakistan-Afghanistan bilateral interaction, very productive, very constructive, and uh, we feel uh, very confident that uh, our common interests uh, which are based uh, on a very broad degree of convergence of interest uh, and uh, convergence of our strategic objectives in building stability and peace and prosperity in the region will, uh, inshallah, bear fruit. Uh, with these uh, words, I wish to welcome my two friends once again in Islamabad. And may I ask uh, the Deputy Foreign Minister of Afghanistan uh, Mr. Luden, to say a few words. Um, thank you, uh, Foreign Secretary Salman Bashir. I am grateful for, uh, for your hospitality, for um, uh, today's uh, more than one engagement, a uh, very, very fruitful engagement uh, that we have had, um, and for um, the very productive session of the uh, fourth meeting of the core group that you very ably uh, chaired today. Uh, I'm very thankful for that. Um, for, for a delightful dinner, by the way, after which it's uh, not easy to, uh, to confront the media. Um, uh, but um, everyone, I am um, um, bringing you greetings from, uh, from Kabul. Uh, I am very pleased to be back in Islamabad. Uh, I wish you a very happy Ramadan. Uh, it's been really nice being back here. As uh, uh, my brother uh, Salman said, it was um, uh, the fourth meeting of the core group that we just finished today. Uh, the, uh, the impression that I can share with you is that um, we are all very encouraged by the fact that it has become quite an established process now. Uh, it's a process that we have invested a lot of uh, uh, confidence, a lot of uh, energy, a lot of time uh, in effort into, and, and uh, we have every reason to believe that it's a pro uh, process uh, that's living uh, up to the expectation and producing uh, 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 good opportunities for consultation, uh, as was just mentioned. We, uh, from the Afghan side, um, are uh, very uh, 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 interested and, uh, and, and very eager uh, to uh, make the core group process into one uh, that's responsive to some of the uh, immediate challenges that um, we all face. In the first instance, we in Afghanistan have a, have a real uh, uh, challenge on our hand in the, the challenges to establish peace uh, and bring to an end the current uh, 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 violence and terrorism in the country. Uh, but we also are aware of the long-term potential for cooperation that exists between the three countries, uh, the potential for economic cooperation, uh, and for the long-term vision of uh, prosperity and peace that this region uh, so much deserves. Uh, 
uh, we bring uh, a message of uh, urgency to the working group. Um, the situation in, in the country in Afghanistan um, is, uh, is, is one uh, that requires uh, 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 the fruits of our cooperation. Uh, we are making progress on the one hand, the transition process has started, which is...